I've been watching dry ice videos, and the record for most dry ice in a pool is a thousand pounds of dry ice, and it's by Tecrex. So, um, we're gonna try to put 1,300 pounds of dry ice in the swimming pool. How much does it cost for a thousand pounds? Like, a thousand pounds? One thousand, three hundred and thirty-five dollars with twenty-five cents. Okay. Okay, cool, yeah, we'll take it. <laughs> this is like, what, four pounds? About that, yeah. This is four pounds and we're gonna throw it in the sink. We have 1,300 that we're gonna throw in the pool. Dump, dump it, dump it. Wow. Whoa! <laughs> Honey, dinner's ready! <laughs> There's your vape. <sighs> yeah. This is like really cool. Why do we do this all the time? David just spent 1,800 Because it was 1,800 <laughs> Oh yeah. <laughs> so this is 300 pounds of dry ice. On YouTube we saw that the record was 1,000. So we just ordered 1,000 more. Did you actually? Yeah. No, you didn't. Yeah. You're doing 1,300 pounds of dry ice? <gasps> yes! Yes! It's actually the perfect vlog. I'm just gonna put it in my room. <laughs> I'll help you too. <laughs> there we go. Thank you for working these hard hours. I do for you. How much are we paying you? Yes. Yes. <laughs> Dude, the ice isn't even in the pool yet, but it looks like it's already affecting the pool. What if right now this shot looks 10 times cooler than what it looks like when we push it off? <laughs> New recap. Uh, we just found out we got a little more ice than we bought, and it's 1,400. Pounds of ice. Joe, what are you modeling for the thumbnail? The thumbnail is just Joe, it's not even the ice. It gets three million views. It's him holding a speck of ice. <laughs> Liza, are you excited? I'm very excited. What are you looking forward to the most? Ice. Yeah, I like that part too. Dry ice in the pool. New camera view. Here we go. In Ready? 10, 9, okay, come on. Stop. 8, oh, wait, wait. Can 7, we stop? 6, 5, I feel like we're in 4, 3, 2, one! Go! Keep going! Keep pushing! Keep pushing! Keep pushing! Keep pushing! Keep going! Oh my god! I feel like I'm working the Himalayas! Being taken advantage of! Cooler! Oh my god! You can't even see where the pool is! Where does the pool start? You'll be in the vlog if you jump in. Ah! Oh, my oh, my god. Oh, my oh my god! Scott! Oh my god! Oh my god! We in the Niagara Falls, bitch! Our house is a different planet. <laughs> I feel like we're in the show Stranger Things. Like the fucking aliens about to come out somewhere. Oh my god! What is that? Scott, look, a beer! How do you feel after breathing carbon dioxide? Kind of lightheaded. Like smarter? Oh yeah. My brain cells, <laughs> I can feel them popping in there. 12.30 a.m. on Sunday. Alex just called me, told me Dom's having sex in my room. This is not happening. <laughs> Dom, what on planet Earth are you doing in my bed? Having sex. <laughs> get up! Hold on, I have a boner. Get up, get up right get now. Up. Oh, you have a boner? You're not the only one with a boner. <laughs> We talked about not having sex in my bed. Get up right now. Well, I thought it'd be a good story for the vlog. Dom, these are my covers. I sleep here. Look at that. That is disgusting, Dom. We said no sex in my room. Okay. <laughs> and what did you do? Does that have sex in your room? <laughs> Alex, what do I do with him? What do I do? I think we should put him down. <laughs> Why don't you have sex in the living room? Or on the fucking balcony. <laughs> or just... Or in yeah. Bailey's fucking cage. <laughs> yeah, I just wanted it to be a good story. This isn't a good story. Alright, well, I'm gonna go finish it. No. What's in there, Alex? Just your shorty award? Damn it! What are you guys doing with this? <laughs> say I'm sorry. Um, Maybe you should say you're sorry, you fucking cock block. <laughs> That was mid-orgasm. You came on my pet? <laughs> no, I didn't. Not that time, but before, yeah. <laughs> well, why don't you just tell Alex? I'm in the living room having sex. Please don't come out there. Well, I thought it'd be more fun for me to have sex in your bed than you might catch me. It's like the thrill. You, know? you got turned on by me catching you? You're like, I can't come, I can't come. Wait, is that David? Uh. <laughs> Alex, and why didn't you kick him out? Did you kick down my when he was having sex in my bed? No, but that was different. <laughs> What did Dom tell you? How did he convince you to go into my room? How did you think it was okay? I did it! He said, he first he took me in and I'm like, this isn't your room. And he's like, shit, it's okay. I remember hearing her saying, what if he tells on him? And I was like, I'm fucking telling him. I'm, I'm a little snitch. Alex calls me and he's like, yo, Dom's having sex in your room. I turned my car around and I went 100 down the highway. <laughs> He's like, we have an hour, and I'm like, he's coming back? Alright, today Liza and I are going in an aquarium, and I hate to make this joke again, but this is what I feel like it's gonna be like. Hello, and welcome to the Honolulu Zoo. <laughs> now come right this way, and I'll show you the most exotic thing you've ever seen in your life. Okay. Now stay back! Okay. And behold, feast your eyes on the rare, exotic, dangerous, pineapple. Oh, that's a pineapple. 
a pin that pala pala la. <laughs> okay, so David's been driving around Hawaii, resting his arm up like this, and his hands in a fist, and it looks like he's just like, white power! <laughs> Welcome to the International Hawaiian Museum of the Hawaiian Museum. Over here we have our oldest slice of pineapple. <laughs> you wanna get some food? Yeah, let's get some McDonald's. What do you wanna get from McDonald's? We get the 40 pack of nuggets. 40 pack of nuggets? 40 pack of nuggets, and I'll split it with you this time. You'll split it with me? Yeah, 37.3. 37.3? <laughs> Can you explain to me how your mouth got weirdly contorted? Can you explain to me why your fingers smell like my butt? <laughs> no, they don't! I'm gonna put these taquitos in the cart, okay? Don't, don't you dare put those taquitos in the cart. Well, what's gonna happen if I put them in the cart? I'm gonna unload a bunch of booyah! So what do I eat? You don't eat anything. You need to not eat for a while. Look down. You can't see your toes, can you? <laughs> Can I grab food? You go. <gasps> A good dinner. <laughs> I'm gonna get some Bacardi. Is Bacardi okay? That doesn't say Bacardi. What does it say? That says boo ha. <laughs> I love large ripe olives. You like large ripe boo ha? <laughs> oh, I used to play with one of these and then I broke it from dropping it on the floor too much. Oh, you had one of these alligators? No, I had a baby. <laughs> I want my girlfriend back. David? Liza? David. Liza, someone took over your body and I can't. Boo <laughs> No more road work! No more road work! No more road work! No more road work! And road work! And road work! And road work! I have an infection. Hey, you wanna see it? Yeah. Oh my god, is it on your pee-pee? Of course it's on my pee-pee. <laughs> Send help. <laughs> Please. <laughs> One appropriate tattoo. <laughs> what happened with his infection? So basically, he has an STD on his leg now. What do you have? Oh my, why are you excited? <laughs> like, what disease is it? What do you- <laughs> Come on, just what do you have? I don't have a disease. Yeah, you you don't have an STD? No. You just do. went to the doctor and have- <laughs> What is this? It's nothing. Is it that just a, candy? It's a goodie bag. It's a goodie Stop. bag? They give you like lollipops. You are <laughs> sulfamethane. Stop. One hundred percent true. Honest. What do you have? No, I just have like an infection in the tattoo. Some cream to keep it from turning into MRSA. What's MRSA? Yeah, <laughs> I know. Wait, is yours infected too? I can't tell. No, his is way worse than mine. You guys should sneak into a hospital when they ask you if you work there. Just be like, look. Oh yeah. <laughs> do you have any proof, sir? Do you have a badge? <laughs> Please. <laughs> what did the doctor say when he saw it? He was like, "How drunk were you?" And I was like. I actually wasn't! Like, <laughs> Do you have any other tattoos? Yeah, I have my porn star diamond. That's my favorite one. Fucking send it! What does that mean? Send it! Oh, yeah, but what does it mean? Send it! <laughs> you never been like, oh, I don't know if I should do it? Fucking send it! Do it! <laughs> Cause we were planning on getting matching tattoos. Yeah. He's like, oh, I don't know what to get. And I was like, I don't either. He's like, whatever, let's just send it. And I was like, we're fucking getting send it. Like, <laughs> Thanks for watching, Kyle. Make sure you like and subscribe. Tweet me at David Dobrik. Guys, look at all this P.O. box Dude, stuff. It's so cute and they're so funny. It's amazing to get like get stuff from you guys, especially when you guys spend a lot of time on it. And, like, like literally all of your handwritten notes are so, so cute and so adorable and meaningful to us. The best part about all of it is that just so we get to share it with our stuff. Liza. I know. But, oh my god! Liza! Oh! This next part in the vlog is some footage that I didn't have permission to use, but I finally have permission for it, and here it is. Corinna, you had sex with Todd yesterday for the first time? Corinna, just spit it out. Yeah, did he use oh, no, she did, she did spit it out. <laughs> oh. Yeah, but I spit, I swallow. Oh. oh. Yeah, so does Big Nick. Yeah. <laughs> when you and Todd hang out, is it romantic? You know how, like, usually people listen to songs when they're together? Yeah. One time, I was by Todd's room, and I heard this song that goes like this. <laughs> So you slept with him yesterday. And I regret it. Why? Well, I saw Jason's vlog. What happened in Jason's vlog? Shooting another girl's number at NYU. Oh. I watched the vlog when it came out fucking yesterday that I went and had sex with him. <laughs> the worst part of the sex is that I look up and it's just David fucking Todd. <laughs> if Todd is watching this right now, what, what do you have to tell him? You can jerk yourself off because I'm never sleeping with you again. Ooh. 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 What's going on? What's going on? Who's this? Corinna. Did we not just have a conversation? Literally a day ago. What are you doing back at Todd's bed? It's okay. Everybody has their weekdays. <laughs> We're all, you know, going to Vegas today. So, like, I'm carpooling. <laughs> Uber pool got a lot more complicated. Now you have to have sex with the people before you go on a drive with them. Pizza guy's here. I think someone ordered pizza for Heath, but Heath doesn't know. And he has to pay for it. Did you order pizza? Did I order pizza? Yeah. No. I knew it. Someone ordered pizza under your name and you have to pay for it in cash. You're lying. Who did? 
<laughs> I didn't order pizza, sir. I'm so sorry. It says it's for Heath, but I didn't order pizza. I'm hey, sorry, HJ, sir. I can't. I, I can't. I can't pay that. I'll pay for it. I'll pay for it. You, you're paying for it. Hold on. What pizza is it? Oh, Barbecue it's... sauce and pepper. Mm mm. Take that shit up. <laughs> you got so drunk last night, you forgot you ordered a pizza this morning. I'm so good to myself. I knew, like, hey, I'm gonna be so hungover tomorrow. Hey, I'm gonna order a pizza, but can you deliver it tomorrow? <laughs> it says play money, Zane. <laughs> I'm gonna call this guy and give him a piece of my mind. Listen here, don't you ever order a pizza, but that was really sweet and thoughtful. Thank you so much. I really do appreciate it, but fuck you. A random person just bought Heath a pizza, and obviously it really pissed him off because he didn't want to pay for it. So right now I'm calling Domino's and I'm gonna order seven pizzas and say it's to Heath. But I just was on the phone with Domino's and I ordered seven pizzas. <laughs> Zane and Toddy, come here real quick. I just got off the phone with Domino's and I ordered seven pizzas under Heat's name. Oh my god. <laughs> the total for my pizza was $48 and Zane told me that's not enough because Heath won't freak out. So now I'm going to add more things to my order. Can I do 10 supreme large pizzas? Uh, $164.51. $164? I'll pay when, once you get here. My name's Heath. <laughs> Open the door. What is it for? Pizza. Pizza. <laughs> <laughs> 13 pizzas. Yes. What's the total? Oh That's right there. Look at the total. It's 100. 100. <laughs> okay, man, you have food for the whole week. <laughs> David, this is not funny. Who is the Dude, oh my god, it's a truckload of <laughs> Truck. Call this bitch right now. Who the fuck is doing Who this? That? It's Dude. all pepperoni. I'm gonna kill somebody. I don't have money. Not, seriously, please. David, I will fucking murder you. How am I paying? You keep telling me to pay. I don't have money to pay. How am I gonna pay? You can't be ordering pizza to my house. I don't, I can't, I can't afford 13 fucking pizzas. David, I can't pay for the pizza. I'm not 13 pizzas. <laughs> That's all you pay. David, I can't afford this. Let me somebody take a picture. This is <laughs> all right, guys. Thanks. Sir, are you mad? Oh my god, he took a picture. You're an idiot. I didn't order it. Quit saying it like I ordered it. You have to call Domino's before they actually call the police. Oh my god, and he took my fucking picture. That's what he was saying. He That's said, I have your picture. Oh my god. I thought he wanted a picture because it was funny. <laughs> oh my god. You did a job for stealing pizza. Here. You're eating the pizza. I'm incriminating myself. <laughs> do I call the cops? What do I say? You should call the cops and you should tell them that your friend David ordered 13 boxes of pizza. Pulling a joke on you and making you think that it was you. You fucking dumbass. As a prank, you ordered me 13 pizzas. You're the best prankster ever. Like, 